All right, uh, so the next one I want to talk about is a chemical that actually was uh, made by Jamie. It's about 1892. Uh, Thomas Wilson was his name, uh, working in the States. He did a reaction where it didn't quite work out exactly the way he wanted it to. And so he thought to himself, rather than cleaning out the container, he thought, let's just throw it out. And what he found was, right out back there was a river. So this uh, water is basically our river here. And uh, when you throw this compound that he had no idea what he'd made into the river, it actually reacts with water. So I've got some of that compound here. It's called calcium carbide. When it actually contacts the river, it uh, forms a gas and a uh, cloudy solid, as well as um, it uh, gives off heat. So I'm going to have to give off a little heat here. So we're going to add a little of this solid in, and you can see that yeah, something um, interesting happens. Right? Uh, yeah, that river would have probably been on fire for about a half an hour or so. Uh, <laughs> gives off a lot of heat, very bright flame. And uh, it went on to uh, be used in uh, miners' caps, uh, acetylene, of course, is used to cut metal, and uh, auto companies just snapped it all up uh, back in the 1890s, that's when cars were first being made. Uh, I'm going to do this uh, reaction in a slightly different container, and that's where, oh, we have the oxygen coming Ah, uh, excellent. So, Come on. 